Hey guys, this is Mark with All American Health. We are a non-emergency wheelchair and stretcher transportation company based out of Florida. Um, we also provide consulting services and digital marketing. We provide PPC, pay-per-click services through Google Ads. Uh, we generate leads for your transportation company. Uh, a lot of our clients have stopped working with brokers and strictly focused on private pay clientele as a result of some of the campaigns we put together for them. Uh, we definitely keep your phone ringing. Um, I received a call from one of my consulting clients uh, yesterday uh, asking about uh, rates uh, for transportation services. And I told them that uh, you have to check your market. And uh, he said, you know, well, you can't just give me some rates, some good rates for my market. And I said, you know, that's not the best idea because your area may be different than someone else's area. So what I told him to do was I told him to call around to a handful of transportation companies in his area and see what their transportation rates were. And that was my homework that I gave him. And I said, and then give me a call back and we'll set up a plan that puts you in, in that market area uh, so that you are you are receiving the type of services uh, and the type of service rates that you deserve for that, that area. He called me back about one hour ago, just before I started working on these videos. And he said, I had no clue that people were charging the type of rates that they were charging in their area. So a, 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 a nugget for you guys is know your market know your area uh, I know in Chicago Chicago charges a minimum for wheelchair transportation services uh, $125 per leg uh, depending on the type of trip but Chicago has quite a few taxes that are connected to providing transportation services in in the Chicago area so of course their rates are a lot higher which of course is rolled over to the client um, but in other areas, you may find that rates are lower, um, but it may not come with as much and as many taxes. Just in the state of Florida alone, depending on if you're in Jacksonville, Miami, West Palm Beach, Sarasota, the, the Tampa Bay area, Orlando, your rates may vary depending on what type of transportation commission is in that area, what type of taxi service you may have to provide. Uh, I know in St. Pete versus Tampa, the rates are a little different because St. Pete has no uh, transportation commission as opposed to Tampa. So a lot of companies start out working in the St. Pete Clearwater area or even the Pasco area as opposed to the Hillsborough County area because they don't want to deal with the, the commission and they make just as much money. So a lot of it is really just what area you're in and doing a little market research to make sure that the services you're providing um, not only are quality services but you're receiving the type of compensation you deserve for those services so always do your research you know never be scared to call another company and see what type of rates they're getting the the, the key is not only understanding what type of rates they're getting but knowing how they're getting them so um, a lot of times the rates that a, a, a transportation company will give you are their private pay rates. They won't give you their Medicaid rates because I guarantee you their Medicaid rates are a lot long, lower than their private pay rates. Um, and what you want to shoot for is bringing in more clients for private pay transportation rates than for Medicaid, Medicare rates. Hopefully this has been helpful. You take care.